Thank you so much for joining us this afternoon. This is meteorologist Eric Tolman with the Michigan News Channel, Southeast Michigan. Uh, just to give everyone a heads up, uh, severe weather is going to be targeting uh, the south once again, and this is going to be the target zone. Our main focus will be down in the south. We have category one, two, three, and four. What do they all mean? Category one is marginal risk. Category number two is slight risk in yellow. Enhanced risk is number three in orange. And in red is moderate risk for uh, severe weather. So once again, for those that don't know, uh, category uh, one is marginal risk for severe weather. Category number two is slight risk in yellow. Enhanced risk in orange is number three, and moderate risk is in red, and that's number four. Now, if we ended up with uh, pink in there, that would be uh, high risk, meaning number five, but we don't have that in uh, the uh, outlook. So uh, this is the setup for tomorrow. Kind of stay tuned with me. Uh, we're going to take a break, and when I come back, we're going to spin the wheel and find out where this is going to go. Uh, so it is going to be directly in this area along along here, but then after that, it's going to start pushing towards the east, and we'll tell you where it's going to end up after this. Stay tuned. We'll let you know. And thank you so much for joining us uh, once again on the Michigan News Channel. We're very glad that you could be here and uh, listen up for these very important announcements. So like I said in the beginning of the show, we did tell you where the severe weather was going to be persistent and active. And after uh, all of that action happens, all of the severe weather that you see down in the south, that is going to continue to push towards the east. So this is going to be uh, what's going to set up for uh, Thursday, uh, March 30th, uh, 2017 at 8 o'clock in the morning on the button. So this is the line of concern. So uh, the only category uh, for severe weather that we have to be concerned about will be uh, one, two, and three, marginal risk. Category number one, slight risk. Uh, category number two, and enhanced risk. Uh, category number three, we do not have a four or five in there. Otherwise, there'd be a red and pink if that was to be upgraded. So. Uh, you can kind of see this is the general area of where the marginal risk uh, section is going to be in the darker green. Uh, over here in the yellow is the slight risk. That's category number two. And over here is category number three, enhanced risk. So those people that live in Little Rock, the Little Rock area, and portions around the Little Rock area will be seeing a uh, uh, good chance of severe weather. So uh, we'll continue to keep you posted and we'll let you know if the forecast models change and we'll let you know where it goes after that. So stay tuned. I'll have that report up later on tonight. But we're giving you heads up that more severe weather is going to be active again and it will be rock and roll once again. And then in Oklahoma City, you'll have a marginal risk of severe weather chances and then down in uh, Forest Worth uh, you'll have uh, you're going to be in between the storm system you'll have thunderstorms and I think a little uh, a little chance of some uh, severe storms so we'll kind of keep an eye on that and we'll let you know if any of the models change uh, within the next several hours but uh, I'll have to look everything over so stay tuned with us on the Michigan News Channel in southeast lower Michigan, we most definitely will keep you opposed to the situation with any kind of uh, breaking news, developments, or anything that does change, we will keep a very close eye on that. So just uh, prepare now for severe weather once again, and it is expected to hit the south again. So uh, Kansas City, you are also in this as well. Marginal risk for you as well. And Jefferson City, marginal risk category number one for you as well. So all areas that are under 
uh, the gun and target for severe weather. Uh, be prepared and ready for action to happen. We'll have more coming up within the hour. Stay tuned. We'll keep you posted on the severe weather situation that will be breaking out in the South once again. Stay tuned with the Michigan News Channel. We'll continue to keep you posted with more updates as soon as we get them. And thank you for joining us. And we'll see you again within the next hour or so with more. Thank you.